Hello YouTube, this is Amazing here bringing, another, bringing you another war game, European Escalation Solo. Today, Mission 3, Counter-Strike. Let's go. momentum is broken and its offensive slowed. The East German government vainly urges the USSR to intervene. Taking advantage of the enemy's weakened state, the Anglo-German forces counterattack. Right, so here we go. We gotta secure Charlie. Anything else? Nope. Okay. More stuff. Right, so we got Panzer Grenadiers. These are quite decent units. Looks like we got some command vehicles. Right, so you now got the Keeftons to call on. Let's bring out the, uh, the earlier ones. The, or the ones from earlier, you could say. Alright. So there's two secondary objectives to secure these guys. I'm going to focus on that. Let's get this. So bring in these guys. These guys. One of you. And then three more just to make a balance. Recon, we've got a huge amount to play with. Gazelles are out of ammo already. Support. I'm going to go full quality for this one and get some Kiep hards. As always, I'm almost certainly pronouncing a huge amount of this stuff for Ron. For this, we've got some Strikers, so British ADGM units. I'm going to set up a few of them to defend uh, Gulf, as there's always a possibility that there's a counterattack coming over here. I'm going to set a Scorpion Recon here, and a Scorpion Recon here. I'm also going to split these gazelles up. don't really need two Recon Helicopters in the same place. It's not really taking full advantage of their uh, usefulness. That's where let's re start regrouping these uh, Leopards. I'm going to try and saturate them with keep tanks. Give them a taste of their own medicine. So to say, but while still having some powerful stuff, uh, VTSI, as I say, group of four, just because I like groups of four, no other reason, logistics, but of course, four supply trucks, and then some infantry to deal with the kind of wooden terrain stuff. Just like that. Alright, let's get you guys regrouped and moved up here. All oh, this is looking very professional, isn't it? Lots of lots of units going everywhere. No, I guess to talk about battle strategies. I don't like forest fighting. It's not my forte, let's just say that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to sweep into Alpha, sweep into Charlie, and probably ignore Bravo. I think there's an also an optional objective of, like, time. Yeah, less than 20 minutes. I'm not going to bother with that. I'm going to take everything slow and steady. So that's all. So basically that's all I'm planning to do. I'm going to take Alpha and take Charlie. No monkeying about it. Bravo. Straight in. Just straight full force. Full force attacks. Now you better have good uh, optics. You have exceptional optics. Also, I'm sure you know when I say good optics, I mean exceptional ones. If you don't, well, you do not. What's that? Oh, Vagos! You sneaky ambushers. 
Ambitious. 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 Mm, well, they definitely have artillery, but. This looks like some uh, Lusks coming in. Those are sort of like the basic. I really could do with some proper AA missiles, but all they have are these blowpipes, which are pretty atrocious AA, so I'm going to bring in a lot of them. I'm also going to get these guys to storm the woods here, covered up by some mortar fire. Supplies are here for those who need it. Oh, why are you being reinforced from here? Why are you doing that? Why are they? What? Seriously, why are they being reinforced? That's not a reinforcement zone. What? What are they doing there? That's cost me a few lives. Looks like a t armored advance from the north. I'm well. I'm assuming it's the north because it's in front of me. It's a quick fire off between these two guys. I'm gonna unload these. Immediately. Just because I'm. Let's unload these guys. Get them to secure the bridge. There's going to be a lot of infantry on infantry, infantry fighting. Because of that, uh, those stupid Fagos. And I don't, don't have any proper artillery to, yet to take them out. I'm going to call in a proper recon for this side as well, and the Lukes. I always love to have recon units that have good optics. But good is all I can get at the moment. I prefer, you know, I prefer very good. Obviously. Let's, let's you guys don't move up here. I'm going to call, push those, uh, M11 threes and yes, because even if the AA is far or not the AT GM they're firing at it, it's not that big a it's not a loss really, and it forces them to use up crucial crucial supplies. Now there's something very odd about this. I'm going to stop recording now, but it seems to be very laggy. And we're back. Uh, I don't know. Perhaps it's just such a unreliable. What's that? Oh! I might need it's over there. Uh, lots of stuff going on. Yeah, this, this, this seems to be a, a largely infantry based fighting, so what do we got? M72s, it's quite a good unit. Quite expensive though. Ah, well. It'd be nice to have some recon infantry. This is calling the M1. And the Jagger can launch their assault. I don't like those um, armored personnel carriers with. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? I'm gonna use. I'm going to start rotating these gazelles. Uh, oh, this frame rate's so bad. It's caused by the... Uh, oh no, don't run in that way. Uh, I don't think that there's any more ATGM. I didn't see any at any rate. Let's just uh, do some uh, general fighting. Uh, yeah, so pretty much they're counter-attacking, holding them it off fairly well. 